僕は負けるわけにはいかないんだ Hello, one and all. This is Toucan, the the Icy Man. What a plan! And welcome to to Smashed Out here in lovely New Rochelle, New York. We got a good show for you guys tonight. I'm sure you already saw um, our previous match. I forgot who was playing. I think it was Plankton and someone else. But we have Fish It versus Shitter in winners' quarters, and this is Smashed Out number 94. So we got a good show for you going on. Right Away from it. Oh, okay. Oh, that's a little bit loud. There we go. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. let me see. Uh, my, mo my mic keeps falling down a little bit. See how it keeps falling down? Thanks, Barry. All right, now that I got my mic fixed, we got Fishit versus Shitter, and it looks like Fish is up once by one stock. Fish is going as trademark DK against Shitter. This is normally a bad matchup for DK. In fact, we pretty much never see DK at all because he's a mid-tier in this game. But, oh my god, that is... Did you see that? Oh, that is just... That is the reason why DK is not good in this game, because of hitboxes like that. I believe he has that problem in Ultimate as well. Or I'm not sure if they fix that or not. Anyway, we got an even game. We got... Um, Three stocks apiece. Um, Fish it is known for being probably one of the best, D probably the best DK in New York. Um, it's gonna be tricky for him because he's combo food against Fox, but it's gonna be interesting to see how he uh, works around Shitter's play. Uh, right now we got Big Buffalo hopping up on the other mic right now. Big Buffalo, what's up? How you doing, man? <laughs> uh, doing okay. Doing yeah. all right. We got. Um, Pretty even match so far between Fish uh, Fish and Shitter. Oh, that's troublesome for yeah, Fish. They, they, they play a lot. Yeah, and I'm yeah. assuming Fish usually wins, but um. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Usually. This is getting, this is really close. It is pretty close, and he's able to get back. Oh, he should have stood on the ledge right yeah. there. Like, I think he was afraid of getting clipped from the uppie, which I understand. That is a little bit tricky. I mean, DK does decimate Fox, but if you know the matchup is Fox, then you can win. Yeah. And wow. he, he, and we've, we've been playing his DK a lot, so we've been, we've been learning. Learning our little tricks, you know? Yeah, I've never faced Fish's DK, and from what I've heard, it's because he just does not like the Ice Climbers matchup. DK, That's why he has a Peach. DK versus Lacey's is horrible. Yeah, from what I've heard, so at least I won't be able to face that. I won't have to face the yeah. DK. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Anyway, uh, still an even game. Look at this pressure from Shitter, but Fishy gets out of it with the up ass shield. That up B comes out pretty fast, yeah. and that side B is going to clip right through it. I, I, I already played I already played one of my goons in Winter's Round 1. I'm playing all my goons. Oh, really? Yeah. I played uh, Lava. He, he, he drove us here. Oh, damn. Yeah. He it was actually really close. I, I won, though. It was really close. Oh, that was a nice game. Oh, oh, very nice, but he gets back. Oh, oh, that was nasty. That, speaking <laughs> of gimps, though, yeah, that was even more nasty right there. Um, this is still very doable for both players. That, oh. oh. Shit or no. Dermot Dur Dur uh. Dur usually plays plays like that. He plays really well, and he just, like, side views on the stage. He does that yeah, all the time. Yeah, he's smiling. He's laughing it off a little bit, but that still has to affect you. That still has to affect you mentally. Oh, definitely. Yeah, and right now the mic is literally in my face right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It, oh my god. Alright. Alright. Like that. Alright. Can you guys hear me? There, the stream's not even on. Like, you're hosting someone. Oh. Uh, Alright. While I try to fix my mic, we're going back to Battlefield for game number two. Oh, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. It's weird. Alright, I think I got it fixed. Okay. Um, so now I feel like Adam's gonna like two, two or three stock him. He's got the download. Yeah. I think yeah. Shooter can do it. Because he just he learned the most important thing uh, at the end of that last game. 
Don't side B off the ledge. Yeah. <laughs> he should have went Falco, maybe. <laughs> he means Falco. <laughs> I don't, yeah, why, I don't know why. I would assume that would be even better because it the is better. Laser, laser yeah, the Falco, lasers just shut DK down. I, th I think I think uh, DK versus Falco is way better. I I, I play I experiment it. I I do better my Falco. You know, I don't even main Falco. Yeah, I don't even play Falco, and I could see it being much better for Falco. Yeah, just you know, Falco is better. Falco is better against low tiers, just in general. Makes sense. So is Sheik. It doesn't matter. Bear. All right. <laughs> We can just commentate for no one. It's fine. Yay. We, wait, are, wait, are we streaming or no? We thought we weren't, but we are. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, see, I told you he's dominating him now. Thank God. Then that means we would be talking to ourselves. Yeah. So now I'm, I'm getting, in winner's quarters, I'm going to run back with Sid. Remember, I, remember he, he beat me last other week? Well, oh, yeah. We're going to run back with him. I got to play well. Good luck with that. Yeah. I don't know who I'm playing. I prefer not to know. I like yeah. I'm not even sure, so. Yeah, because if I know who I'm playing, I get nervous and stuff like that. So I prefer yeah. not knowing. Yeah. No, I th we 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 did a grudge match uh, at Vortex's house on, on Monday. And I won five. It was a it was first to five. I won five four. <laughs> wow, <laughs> that was close. Yeah, he was up two zero too. I, I I made I made a comeback. <laughs> pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. Everyone, everyone was like freaking screaming. It was it was a, it was a great it was a great night. It a sounds great pretty crazy. Yeah. Yeah. It was a great match. All right. So anyway, back to this match. Uh, Shitter finally gets on the board with a stock. He still has a bit of a mountain to climb in terms of per percent and stock. You could just you know you you could give DK with a shine. You definitely can. I know it is a little bit tricky. It, it's, with the it's, it's it's very tricky. You gotta do it like for very precise timing. Yeah, or, or it's it's risky too because then if you get upbeat, you're gonna get stuck under battlefield. I don't know why he went back to battlefield. Yeah, that I, I I I prefer like uh, against DK maybe Yoshi's so you don't get stuck under the stage. Yeah. Because because then if he goes FD or Pokemon, you can just grab him and chain grab him. Makes a lot of sense. So ban FD and Pokemon probably. You know, Final Dreams is okay, but I don't I I, I don't like because it, it can screw you over a little bit because of the platforms that could lead to some chain grabs. And Yoshi, stuff. Yoshi's my Yoshi's my favorite stage against any. Oh, oh that's nice. The clap, clap your hands. Yeah, clap your hands for. Oh yeah, fish for, it. For, yeah, there, for there was, there, he's making a comeback though. Definitely yeah. is. He, def he definitely can still. Uh, sure, can definitely still come back. Oh, yeah, um, he's only down the uh, stock. Uh, no follow-up, unfortunately. I think he could have gone a second up air. Yeah, a bit, but really, really tight. <laughs> yeah, but it still could have been done. Yeah. There's the shine. I should grab it. Oh. Oh, he barely gets back. All right, that might have been a. That I think Fisher went for a read right there. That's it. Doesn't get it. All right, so Shitter needs to make sure he doesn't side B off the stage this time because this is the same exact time. This is almost a looking same, same exact look. game. Yeah, his last game. Yeah. Uh, but let's see what he can do. He um, yeah. currently is a little bit behind. Yeah. All right, good punishing the uppy right there. Oh, yeah. A little bit of flubs right there. All right, he can uh, get this. Definitely get this. All right, he's definitely putting the pressure on. He does get clipped by the uppy, but he doesn't get hit too much. What was that? Did he spot dodge right there? Uh, Tim, my buddy Tim's hoping Dermot can win, right, Tim? You're hoping that Dermot, can, Dermot wins. Because <laughs> right. then Tim gets a... Gets a gets a win in the winner's final. <laughs> That's what he thinks. <laughs> All right, so this is still uh, looking very doable uh, for both players. It's anyone's game right now. Uh, yeah. this, this but it looks like it. Fisher just keeps getting punished. All right, Darren soon is his nervous stuff. I can oh, tell. Oh, he went for a read right there. I, I appreciate the effort. Uh, I, I do this too. Last, I get nervous. Just do random up random up smash. That's like, is it? No, he's just no uh, he. You know, he had to get off because he didn't have yeah. any ability. Yeah, it's it's hard. It's hard to go DK. All right, so uh, DK is one up smash away from dying. Or up air. Or up air. That too, that too. But that back air is going to put oh. Fox in a bad position. Yeah, he's good. He's good. Comes the recovery, the back air. Well, he's good. He's, he's good. Uh, he does uh, not make it back. That, that, that was close. That, that was very close. Very good stuff to fish it to clutch what? out that game. That was closer than I expected. Yes, Way closer. That, that was a lot closer than I expected. All right, we got Tim. Cuss versus Brolock. All right, so let's see what's gonna happen. Yeah, Tim's Tim's been talk uh, talk with some mad shit. Yeah, he's he's gonna do good. Yeah, Tim talks a lot of stuff, a lot of crap. Like, right, yeah. like he like he does he kind of does. Like yeah. I, I don't mean that as an insult at yeah. all. Cause I mean That's people cool. do it all the time. I talk a little shit a little bit too. Yeah. I mean I always do it just to joke around, not to rub it in people's faces or anything. Cause yeah. at the end of the day, it's a game. You're we're all friends here. Most yeah. of us are friends here anyway. I don't want to mention anything. But of course. Well, yeah. actually, as far as far as I know, there's like no one. That's what I love about the New York scene. There, there's the yeah. toxicity level. Much, nice. It's much lower than well 
I hate to hate on my own state, but Connecticut. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know what uh, you mean. Yeah, but um, oh, Puff. very interesting. Oh yeah, so Brolock remains Peach. Is I didn't know he played Peach. Oh yeah, I play I play on bracket before. Oh, yeah. Bro oh, Brolock beat JLo to get here. Oh, he did. Oh, that's. I think that might be a bit of an upset. That that definitely is. Because JLO is a really good Yoshi player. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if there's any other Yoshis in, in New York. Yeah. There certainly really are. There really aren't any in Connecticut. I can tell you that. I mean, there yeah. is my friend Christian, but he has Yoshi as a secondary, which he only picked up for Ice Climbers, and he has yet to take a set off of me with a, yeah. with Yoshi. I mean, he's taking games, but not a set. Yeah. Um, shout out to my friend uh, Christian. Mike, wave your head. You got. You were awesome. <laughs> um, and it's then there's actually another Yoshi player whose tag is literally Yoshi. Yeah. I've only played him once at Game Haven while that was still open. Um, and I haven't really played him ever since then. I did go over like yeah. someone's house one time and play yeah. him in the basement. But um, maybe yeah, maybe, awesome maybe Brolock's been level, leveling up. You know? Yeah. Anyway, we got um, Concuss versus Brolock. Game one going to Battlefield. And we got Cuff versus um, Peach. And this... A lot of people consider it to be uh, Peach's worst matchup. Uh, there's not too too much Peach can do. I mean, we have a lot of trades. There's not much she can do to challenge that back air. Comes out faster than her fair yeah. and is disjointed. Uh, Peach does not have a lot of combos on Puff, especially not at this percent. Yeah. T Tim, uh, I know this is Puff favorite, but Tim hates playing against Peach. Hates it. Really, it's interesting. Yeah. It's still, it's probably because like maybe we don't have a lot of peaches here. Definitely don't. I I, I consider myself really good against peach nowadays. I, 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 if you want to laugh, I do too. Like all my friends from Westcon say that the only person in our friend group that does not have a peach problem is the ice climbers player. Yeah, that's AKA weird. Me. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah, it, and yet that's kind of untrue because it's a horrible matchup for ice yeah. climbers. But um. Hey, li li lately, uh. You know, I, I don't really use, lose the peaches usually, but you know what happens. You know, uh, playing bad to get down smash, it does happen. It does. It, it, yeah. cause th you you too, too, you know. You get you too, you know. You just, just get blundered. Yeah, it happens. Sometimes it, you I get blundered, sometimes the blunder blends you, I guess. I don't know. Yeah. And I'm, I'm always holding down because I'm trying to shine, you know. Yeah, I used to hold down because of a uh, crouch cancel down smash. I don't really do that too much. I don't really do that in this matchup anymore because it just leads to very bad things. But... Yeah. Uh, but Tim is willing to play patient today. I'll tell yes, you that. I love the duck to avoid the hitbox of the dash attack, and he just gets a forward smash for that. Yeah. Oh, no punish, no grab. Okay. So boring. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm actually starting to yawn. Uh, putting put you to sleep. And also, Tim's afraid to go for rest on Peach. Why is he afraid to go for rest on Peach? He uses the weird hurt box, but... You shouldn't be afraid... Uh, even yeah, because... Even at 47, even at 47. Yeah, He's I not mean, gonna do anything. He yeah, Pe what's she gonna do? Down smash you? Even yeah. then, it's not gonna do too much or puff. Yeah. Can't. Nah. He, just gets, he has to get his confidence up yeah. for this uh, I, I, also, I always go for rest on Peach. When I used to make Puff, I always did. Always. And Puff has a lot of steps on Peach, like, yeah, uh, like for, uh, for uh, rest uh, I do, that uh, she can't get on I, other characters. Uh, oh, oh that's a stitch! Oh, boy. He, he threw it away. But he didn't catch it, I mean, you know what I mean? Mm. He didn't catch it. Well, we have a dead even game right now. Oh, yes. Uh oh. Not anymore. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Take a nap. Yes, <laughs> take a nap. Tim's always wearing these. Oh, they're both wearing USA shirts. You know what's that? Oh yeah, <laughs> USA represent. Yeah. He needs fast precision on Peach. He's always like he's missing these back airs for some reason. Yeah, he definitely needs to work on this yeah. matchup. Yeah. I know, like I know, like uh, Puff usually wins, but if you're not good at the matchup, then you're not gonna win. Exactly. It doesn't matter if it, you know, if it's favored, you know. Yeah, you don't it, it's all on paper. Yeah, but if you don't know it or someone's better than you, you can lose. Oh, yeah. All right, let's start for Brolock for this game. Oh, my God. It's been a four-minute game. Please. Oh, my God. You should rest. You should, I, would, I would rest that in a heartbeat at second place. Oh, rolling. He's not rolling. Like Please end this with a rest. Come on. Yeah. Actually, while this is going on, I'm actually going to head up the bathroom, so right. I'll be right back. I'll, ent I'll entertain. Yep, yep. Alright. RTO is falling asleep too. <laughs> no, he's not. 
Alright. Nice bears. Back air. Floating, floating. The plane is very patient, I would say. Yeah, that's what that's that's what Brolic needs to do. Throw more turnips. You know, that, that's yeah. There you go. See, it worked out. All right. All right. All right. Unlikely even he'll make this comeback, but he could try. All right. Let's see. I think he banned Dreamland. I I can't hear. This bracket. Coming to chat to you guys. It's okay. Ready? Found a dream. All right, this is a good pick. Good pick. Oh, I'm just trying to get through rest. All right. Good recovery. Rest. No. It's <sighs> back here. There you go. He's adapting to the Peach matchup. It's unbelievable. Oh, you have a closet? <laughs> you have a closet in there? Oh, office. Oh, he finally went for the rest. Excellent by Tim. Okay. Alright, Tim is definitely adapting. You know. Yeah, two stock lead and floaty though, it's really hard to come back. He can, but it's really hard. There you go. That was a nice read. Nice to like read in the drift. He's gonna go for the rest. I could tell you he's up. He's up a couple stocks. He's gonna, oh, I knew he was gonna go for the rest. I did call it. I know him. No one's popping in the chat, huh? There, I'll do something in the chat. There you go. All right. <laughs> I love giving the fist bumps. All right, it's back airing as usual. All right, he had the right read, trying to get the ledge. All right. Tim gets impatient, he can't come back. Impatient Puff does die to Peach. That's probably it. Nope, not yet. Stalling a little bit. Oh, nice. nice. I didn't know Tim could do that. I forgot he can do that. That's a, that's a two cent. Roll in? No. He's not rolling in, Tim. He, he knows he's going for the roll and rest. That's it. <laughs> Good win by Concussed. He's in the winner's semis now. Let's fish it. Wonder who's playing next. Probably Toucan. It, no, it doesn't say in the screen. <laughs> I mean, they can play again. It's actually gonna be you. Me? Uh. Yeah. Oh, here we go. I'm playing my playing my arch nemesis. Wish me luck, boys.
All right, guys. Two came back. We got uh, Big Buffalo versus Sid right now. Winners quarters. Uh, looks like this is just getting started. We have a dead even game. Not even a minute in. We got. I believe Big Buffalo is the. Uh, is he the green fellow? I'm not sure because I thought he goes red, but I don't know. Yeah, oh yeah, he's green, he's green. God knows the Carl tag. Alright, very good gimp right there to take the stock. Uh, but uh, Sid takes it right back. Dead even game. Oh, ooh, no punish on that. Looks like Big Buffalo is going for a hard read, but Sid SDs, no. Alright, good charge off smash. There's the Gimp. He's gonna make it back. Alright, good pun good crouch cancel punish by Sid. Alright. Uh, good dare to get back on. That is, won't be the game. Shields the side B. Uh, punishes the get up down smash. Bad DI. This could be doing it. That's it. Big Buffalo 2 stocks Sid to take game number one. So let's see where Sid is going to go with uh, his counter pick. And it looks like we're going to FD. Alright, looks like Sid is chasing down Carl. Punches the no get up. Good shine to a uh, good shine right there. Oh, he tries to gimp him, but he gets side B. Good recovery though by Carl. S match does not connect. Oh, Carl just falls off. That's his bad. This is a bad situation, but he gets back on. Oh, Carl's just going out there. Up smash will take the first stock, going to Sid. All right, good little string right there. S smash is gonna seal it. Three stocks piece, still anyone's game. Very good string right there. Oh, bad situation for for Sid, and he gets shine spiked. Big Buffalo with a pretty good lead right now. And he's just tagging on the percentage, already laughed in terms of percent. Very nice string right there, it's gonna numb 72% worth of extra credit. Goes for the charge F smash to read, does not get it. But Sid does not recover properly. Potential three stop for Big Buffalo. Sid on his torment stock, uh, torment life. I mean, not his torment life, his winter stock life. Winter side life. And that's it. Big Buffalo takes a clean three stock 2-0 for the Big Buff. And it looks like I'm playing Red Jacks next, so I will see you guys on the flip side.
What's up, everybody? Toucan, back on the mic. Next up, we have Fishit versus Concussed, a very interesting set. Um, so we have Concussed, who's pretty much going to go Puff, and Fishit, who I'm assuming is going to go DK. Um, I don't think he would ever go Peach. Who would go Peach in this matchup? If you have a Peach in a secondary, why would you go Peach against Puff? There's no reason to. Uh, so it's going to be interesting to see how Fishit how is going to take this Puff. Contestants unraveling their controllers, or well, rather, con Concussed is doing unraveling his controller right now. Yep, and there's the DK. Alright, this is Winter Semi, so this is going to be our first best of five set. Which means no bands in between games. Mike, are you excited? Because I'm excited. Looks like we're going to game one. Game one, we are going to Yoshi Story. We're just waiting for our players to finish setting up. And here we go. Okay. So this is a small stage to start off on. Uh, this is going to be a very interesting matchup because I never seen Puff against a DK. Um, I'm pretty sure these two have played before. I just don't know um, if I've seen it before. But it looks like uh, Fishin has the early lead. Good back air to get Puff off the stage. Another back air. Good DI and concussed part though. Oh, very nice combo. He goes for the rest. I agree with him, but unfortunately his spacing, his uh, aim was a little bit off on that, and he's going to get clapped for that. First, not going to go to fish it. As we can see, uh, Kakus is being a little bit more aggressive than he was against um, uh, the Peach player he played last time when he, uh, he was on stream. Oh, that dare clipped him. A little bit surprised. Maybe he caught the hurt box in his back here. Oh, that Dong Punch is going to take it. Concussed down two stocks, and Fisher has a pretty good lead right now. And he recovers high, very smart move. You want to recover high against Puff. And actually, DK's recovery does um, come into handy right there. It doesn't get make him get too much vertical mo momentum, um, vertical uh, height, so he can avoid um, he can avoid getting up aired. But he is going to fall right there. So, he, but he is still up a stock. Oh. That could have been a potential jab reset rest right there. And with DK being a big meaty target, he's easy rest. Uh, he's uh, easy to get rested. Oh, the up B coming out in clutch. Here comes a grab. No follow up. And here come we have some edge guarding. Good back air right there. Fish it up two stocks. Concussed on his last stock for this game. And Rest is pretty much on. Well, Rest is still on the table, but he's going to get punished. Uh, maybe not off the. Alright. Rest is pretty much off the table right now. Good forward air. I would have gone for back air right there. But the. Oh, he gets clipped by the up B. That up B really tough for Puff to challenge because all its hitboxes are vertical. I mean, not vertical, but horizontal. And Puff. Puff's best moves are all horizontal. That uh, that forward smash will take the stock, but uh, Concuss has a bit of a mountain to climb. That back air is not. Gonna, it's just going to end it off right there. Fish is not going to give Concuss a chance to make any more progress that game. We're going to go to game two. So let's see where Concuss is going to go. I think we're going to go FD. Yes, we are. All right, Fish is charging up the Dong Punch. I know it's called Giant Punch, but that. I don't even mean to call it Dong Punch, but it's it's just a generic name, Giant Punch. Like, why can't you just, why can't it just be Monkey Punch? I think that sounds like a better name, and more appropriate than Dong Punch. All right, I should stop saying that. Um, so, Fitz has got the lead right now. Uh, here comes a grab, he punches that rest, I mean the, the pound. That was a very nice rest right there, and Concuss gets his first lead of the set. That down smash is going to take the stock, though. But we have a dead even game. That lead did not last long at all. All right, 
right, so on this stage, I can see why Concuss wants to uh, want to go to the stage. He can more easily space his back airs, which is very important for this matchup. That oh, that punch just hit him. I like that was really. I'm really surprised that hit. For as bad as a hitbox as that as that move has, that was a very strange hit. And Fish is doing a good job keeping Concuss off stage, even though he wasn't hitting him. Concuss barely going to survive right there. Great DI, but sitting at 91%, he can't take another hit. Another up smash, uh, another up B near the ledge is probably likely to do it. That initial hitbox of the up B has a lot of knockback. And that's good. That, that can spell certain doom for uh, Jigglypuff if she gets caught right near the edge again. The weak hit of back air, not going to do it. All right, just squeaks under the, the second back air. That third back air will do it. Third time's the charm. Now Concuss has to find a way to take a punch. He interrupts the the the, the, uh, the neutral B. I gotta stop calling it Dawn Punch. It turns out that big of a deal, but I don't know. All right, and Fish is still sitting at 135. That attack not going to do it right there. Uh, he gets clipped by the up B. Another up B he gets clipped by. That down smash is going to get punished. The follow-up is punished, though. DK does not have that many follow-ups on Puff with his throws. That should be it. That's a back air. I would have gone for up air. I'm not sure if up air would have killed because DK is pretty heavy. Heavier than your standard uh, viable character. All right, he did get 81% of extra credit on that stock, so um, Fish is looking pretty good. Oh, but that the rest of that shield is going to punish that smash attack, but the clap is going to even it right back up. But that rest is what can, just what Concuss needed to get back into, that game, into this game. I would have gladly have taken that trade. Very good stuff to Concuss. He is one rest away from taking game number two. Oh, but the Dong Punch. Oh, God damn it. Giant punch. Double up B coming out. Another up B. It's going to take it. Like I said earlier, that up B at his shield, while it is grounded, has a very powerful hitbox. So that just caught Concussed from center stage. And Jigglypuff being one of the lightest characters in the game, it's not going to last too long against that. So. Concuss is down two games. Probably not gonna go. Looks like he's not gonna go to. Well, I probably would go FD one more time. Might as well. And he does go FD. He takes my advice. Take two cans advice, Concussed. Good job. All right. That very nice rest setup to start off the first game. Start up the third game. All right. So Kukus needs to, all right, he needs to space out his attacks a lot better. Got, he has to choose his approaches carefully, being careful not to get hit by up the ice shield. It's pretty tricky. Another rest setup from Concussed. Up two stocks, now up only one. But two rests, two stocks taken by rest back to back. Oh, that could have been another one right there. DK may have survived it, though, because he was only at 12%. Up the uh, shield coming out right there to get him off. Another up the uh, shield. Goes for the pound. Not going to get punished. Another, a third rest. And here's the clap. He's going to survive that, though. Another up uh, shield. Not good DI on Concussed's part. He did, I guess he wasn't expecting that. Then again, who is expecting the DK pick? It seems like Concussed has learned a lot this last game, from the last two games. All right, he shields it. I mean, he was ready for it that time. Unfortunately, it does shield poke. But thankfully, he gets the weaker hit, so he's not going to get um, not too far back. Back throw. Here comes the back airs. Another back air. Clips the up B. That's it. Game three going to Concuss. He's finally on the board. But now it is Fishit's counter pick. So I want to see where he's going to go. Probably a triplat. 
that's not too lar that's probably not too large. I mean, probably not too small. So like, I think you'd probably avoid Yoshi's. Battlefield seems like a good pick. I think he's gonna go Battlefield, and he is. All right, game four, Battlefield. All right, so DK has a lot more space and more platforms to get some more combos on Jigs. Jigs has a little bit less space to um, get her combos off, especially uh, since uh, DK can now just stay on the platforms. All right, punches the upbeat. Get up attack is gonna knock Jigs away. The up tilt is gonna get punished by a back air out of shield though. Another upbeat, barely lives. That move is just really good on Jigs. Oh, he's open. Oh, not too big of a punch by Concussed. Just gets back in time. Oh, the giant punch. Gonna take it. And he's off stage. That won't do it, but he grabs the ledge and that's gonna do it. Oh, another up the uh, shield. And there's not too much that Concuss can do about that. So every time he goes in, like, he just gets hit by it. And it can kill, too. Oh, nice combo right there from Concuss with the, with the up airs. Oh, the clank with the up smash. That, no punish. Gets clipped. Up the out shield, not gonna take it. Back air, good DI. Up air takes it. And this shit's looking pretty good right now. <sighs> uh, that might have been a bit of a miss input right there, that up smash. Alright, these two are just feeling each other out. Trying to not commit too, too hard. Oh, alright. Shields the giant punch. Oh, okay, down smash. Not gonna, not gonna clip. Yuppie, bad DI. And Concuss is down to his last stock of winners. And Vicious sitting, sitting at the magical percent of 69. Not anymore. Alright. That get up attack is pretty good to get uh, Jigs off the stage. Everyone take notes on DK's get up attack. The cargo throw to up air. Punches the air dodge with a grab. Oh, good duck to avoid the giant punch. Oh, he went for the rollout. I think Concuss is getting a little bit desperate. And that's it. Bumps off the the side of Battlefield. And we're done. 3-1 for Fisher. And I think I gotta play next. So Concuss showing, I mean, uh, Fisher's showing that his DK not to be messed with. And oh boy. Time for me to face my demon. All right, I will see you guys on the other side. Peace.
back on the mic. We got Concuss versus J Lo. Uh, pretty even right now. This is very inter interesting. As uh, seen from Ansa versus Hungry Box, this is supposed to be a very. This is supposed to be a bit of a war of attrition. Right, we're about two minutes in. Both players are down a stock. Good arms to tech on the F smash. Good F smash by J Lo. I'm gonna take a stock. Alright, J Lo gets back to the stage. Still has a double jump down beast to the ledge. Just gets back. He doesn't have a double. Oh no, he still has his jump. But he just doesn't matter. He can't make it back. Ooh, very good um, uh, double jump cancel to get out of that rest setup. Right now, uh, J Lo is just uh, spacing his back airs right now. Not really a disjoint move. That's a setup right there. Not barely doesn't kill. Ooh, very good. Uh, waiting out the forward smash right there with some tricky movement. Whoa! That's a light shield. Oh, she's just throwing his eggs. Alright, Nero's gonna seal the stock. JLo's up by one, going into the final stock of the- going into Concussive's final stock of the game. Good punishing the um, the mash out of B with a with an egg. Didn't want to commit too too hard because if you put that to if you get put to sleep by that that's a free rest. <sighs> I think he didn't have a jump, so he just down beat. But J Lo's still in a good position right now. Sitting at 92%. Oh, well, Concuss is sitting at 92%. All JLO needs is a good smash attack. Or Nair just needs to get him off stage. Oh, you're going the back airs. Ah, he eats 39% from that. Ooh, potential rest setup. Alright, gets out of it. Good shield dropped up air to take the last stock and J Lo fishing at the magical percentage. We're going to game two. Let's see where Concuss is gonna go. And I think we're going to FD, we are. Very good pick against Yoshi's considered probably Yoshi's worst stage. Not there's no platforms he can use his tricky movement on. So let's see where this cat we'll see what goes. So let's see what goes on. Oh the back ears. He may armor through it, but he still eats the damage. And J Lo just shooting some eggs right now, trying to keep his distance. He doesn't get punched to get on. Uh, and I don't think he has a jump. He does not. Okay, 
JLO trying to get um, trying to end off the stock before his percent climbs too high. Bath Smash not gonna take it. PTI by Concuss. I thought that I'm sure that was gonna take it. That up air will take it though. Okay. Three stocks apiece. Alright, that's a pretty good start. 30%. He tries to go for the egg lay, and then he gets a, a foot in his tongue. Ooh. No punish right there. Or no up smash, I should say. And these backers are just eating right through the eggs. Oh, no follow-up. This is a too hyper step. Up smash again doesn't take it. Oh, goes for the hard up smash. And that eats his jump, goes through the armor. JLo's down another stock. Still doable. Cuss is just one smash smash attack away from losing a stock. Good Nair right there. That's him off stage. Alright. Alright, JLo's already at 49% and it's climbing right now. He's gotta he's gotta have an answer to this Jaylee Puff. He's gotta finish the stock now. Concuss sitting at 134. He's just he can just be blown on and that's it. But he's racked up 104% of extra credit on J-Lo. Yes, Smash is going to get a shield. The Nair finally takes the stock, but J-Lo ate 114% on that stock. So um, he needs to find a good way to just to just get make that percent climb on Concussed. 151 and off stage. All right, he gets back to the ledge. And we're throwing a bunch of eggs right now. Finally, he lands one. That fair is gonna get, get 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 eaten up by that bear. Another bear. Good DI. Still living at 179. That's gonna take the double jump armor away. And J Lo is down to his last stock on this game. Counter pick working out very well for Concussed. He's sitting at a nice 37 percent. His third stock. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm a little bit tired. Oh uh, my god. Good down smash right there. All right, good parry. Well, well, yeah, good parry right there. Not a, a ch real parry. I call it a parry because he just he just double jumps up, armors through it. That could be a bit of a parry. And smash barely makes it back. Oh, the charge up smash is gonna take it. And Cuss smiling, he's like, I can't believe that hit me. All right, that and just like that, one stock apiece. However, JLO sitting at 97%. Can he hold on and bring this to a game th and uh, take another game? Up smash, not going to connect. He was very late on that. Should have did that a little bit earlier. Oh, the roll to avoid the uh, F smash, but unfortunately that means no punish. Oh, no! The up B, I don't know if he had a jump right there. But it's one one game apiece. And now it's JLo's counter pick. He sits back in his chair while he reflects on that game and decides on where to go. I have a feeling we're gonna go to Yoshi's. It is Yoshi's best stage. And not just because it's his home field advantage. I say that every time, but it's actually a very good stage for Yoshi. And we are going to Yoshi Story for game number three. And we got the pink Yoshi. This match is pink! Alright, so the reason why this stage is pretty good for Yoshi, lots of platforms, allows him for a much more trickier movement, but he does get 
arrested right there. Here comes a punish, though. And Dora, unfortunately, doesn't get a, the fair right there. Kaikas is looking pretty good right now. Good down smash. Oh, that didn't even hit shield. The lip of Yoshi's story coming in clutch right there. Good down smash. I think that was a crouch cancel down smash right there. We have an even game in terms of stocks. And we got Egg Mania going on right now from JLo, who's sitting at 103% right now. He's got to find a way in, and it's, the thing I've been seeing from JLo is that he, when he can't, when he get does get in, he can't capitalize that much off of uh, concussed. And it's hard enough for him to approach through um, Jigglypuff's wall of pain moves. So he needs to find a good way to get in. Good tech away from Concuss, though, to prevent any more damage from being done, though. And while he can't armor through it, Jigs is just a character that Yoshi can't get too many combos on just because of her floatiness. Good down tilt right there. Yep. Yeah. Wow, that just took it. I'm a little bit surprised that that kill. That was, I mean, it is puff, but it was still kind of low. Good couch cancel down tilt right there. Egg Mania coming out right now. More eggs. Good Nair. Shield pokes. Or either he drops shield. I don't agree with that egg roll. Egg rolls Yoshi's worst move. It's pretty much useless. Alright. Get a low down to his last stock. Oh, he's going for the reads. He wants the fin he's he's hungry for that kill. and he needs it. Uh, no punish on that F smash, unfortunately. But that double jump cancel will get Puff into the air. The forward tilt. The forward tilt takes it. Very interesting. Never seen four tilt killed before from Yoshi. Okay, so this is still doable. Very good wave land to get on to uh, some four tilts. All right, Egg Mania coming out from J Lo. I'm just gonna call it Egg Mania every time he just spams eggs. And that forward air is gonna cut through the armor and take it. Concussed up. 2-1. We're going to game number four. And this set is currently in Concussed's favor right now. So let's see what he can do about this. I think we're going to run it back to Yoshi's for game number four. There we go. So let's say, pick it before I go to sleep. All right, starting off with an egg and a forward smash. Oh, pretty good fair to up air. And JLO finds himself with the lead right now. This must be adapting a little bit. It's still early in the game. Oh, ho, 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 ho. trying to go for the reads. The hard reads. He does get the up smash to get the kill. An uncharged up smash. And he's up. <sighs> Another up smash. Not going to do anything. He gets shielded. And no double jump. He can't make it back. Wow. 
Ooh, very nice string right there. Let me turn around near. Oh no, he gets punished by the uh from the down B, but he's gonna live, but no punish, he does not get back in time. Good down smash, he gets the stock. Alright, JLO looking pretty crisp this game. I definitely want to see more uh, double j uh, shield drops from uh, JLo, because that's one of Yoshi's strong points. If he can oh no! Randall screws up his recovery, and that is an unfortunate SD, and just like that, the game is even again. That is very big in this set, as Kakust is just one game away from going to loser semis. Rest is going to get shielded. Up smash. Gonna connect. I was a little bit scared that that wasn't going to connect because it was the reverse hit, but JLo knows the matchup better than I do. And he's up. Hmm. JLo loves going for these up, these up smashes against Puff. There's another one. Oh, the uh, egg toss gets punished by the F-Smash. Alright, tournament stock for JLo. Let's see if he can wrap this up and force a game five. He loves these F-Smashes. The charge one is not going to kill, though. Next one will, though. Puff sitting at 85%. Here comes Eggmania, though. Eggmania is running wild or scrambling wild. I love my egg scramble. Thank you very much. Although I do like... Uh, hard, well, not hard-boiled, but um, uh, over-easy on a burger. And J-Lo going over-easy on that down smash to finish off Concuss. And we are going to game number five. I'm suddenly hungry for eggs. All right, so Concuss cannot go back to FD. It looks like we're going to go... Battlefield, the Game 5 fist bump, that sportsmanship. Here we go, game number five. This is for all the marbles of Loser's Quarters. Loser is out of the tournament. All right, looking strong from JLO, coming out right out of the gate, 50% on the board. Good shield drop. Just like I said last game, JLo needs to get more shield drops on this pup. And he answered right back right there. Up smash. Not going to take it. Next one will do it. The up air will easily take that stock. He is up one stock to, to none. Let's go. And these fares are leading into some good damage for JLo. He's stuck at the edge, but oh, he should have went for Nair there in my opinion. But he does get some good damage. Not getting too punished right now. Still sitting at 40%. All right, punches that up smash. He gets meteored into the ground. Meteor can meteors cannot be um, teched in this game. They can be canceled with a jump, but they cannot be teched. All right, JLo looking very strong. Two stocks up, only at 64%, which is the game that both of these characters were introduced in. The more you know. Dun, 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 dun. All right, good up smash right there. And he gets forward smashed. All right, Concuss not looking too too hot this game. He's down two stocks. He's got to get some uh, something going right now if he wants to continue on. S smash, not gonna take it. Good di on J Lo. Also, Yoshi is surprisingly heavy. All right, he's sitting in his egg, and Yoshi cannot jump out of his shield, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, the the air dodge to avoid the up smash. Very smart from Concuss. This isn't looking good. Another down B, but a good DI right there. Oh no, a little bit too far with that down B, but JLo's still in a very good position. Up three stock, up by a stock. Only at 19% up, but Concuss is getting something started. And here comes the wall, here comes the wall of pain. And here comes Eggmania! And the but here comes back air the back airs I'm not gonna call it back air mania, that just sounds a little bit weird. 
Good down smash to punish the getup. Concussed on his torment stock down by two stocks. Jailo sitting with three stocks and 98%. Can he bring this through and, and have a clutch comeback? JLo showing some great adaption this entire set, but Concuss still showing very solid work. However, he's at 70%, he's at kill percent. This is not looking good for our Puff main. Here comes the... Oh no! That's gonna clip him, and he was still in hit stun, so he could not grab the ledge. Alright, so Concuss still has a bit of a mountain to climb, sitting at 89% right now. One good attack is gonna do it. 99% off the stage. Here comes Eggmania! All right, J-Lo looking for a strong finish. Up air, takes it off the top. J-Lo with the clutch finish, two, finishes the set. Three, two, very good stuff to both players. And J-Lo moving on into loser semis. And I'm pretty sure I have to play him up, up next. But right now, we're gonna take a break from losers and head on back to the winner's bracket. We got Fish It versus Big Buffalo. Mm. You know what, you know, Buff Big Buffalo's tag always reminded me of Buffalo Wild Wings, and I love Buffalo Wild Wings. Anyone who knows me knows I love Buffalo Wild Wings. What if we had, what if Buffalo Wild Wings started serving eggs with their wings? I think that'd be a good combination. What do you think, Bear? I was saying, what if Buffalo Wild Wings started serving eggs with their, with their wings? Well, Wild Wings is really good, so I recommend it. I don't know. I don't know. That's that's a shout out to uh, back to when I wanted to become a chef when I was little. Yeah, here's your two can fact of the day, everybody. When I was little, I wanted to become a chef. That didn't really work out too well because I was busy playing Mario Sunshine and other games at the time. But one day I'll probably pick up cooking because I'm probably gonna have to cook for my wife's every once in a, wife every once in a while. Not married, not married yet. I haven't even had a girlfriend yet, but working on it. But someone get on that. Let me know how... Try Buffalo Wild Wings with some fried eggs. Maybe it's good. I don't know. I think I'm a little bit hungry right now. Um, so we got Fish It and Big Buffalo City in Winner's Finals right now. Two very powerful players. Um, it's going to be interesting to see how this goes. I'm pretty sure these two have played before. Carl stepping up to the setup. I'm gonna check Pokemon Go really quickly to see if there's anything good around. All right, Fish are going DK. I mean, we can only assume that Buffalo is gonna go um, Fox. Yep. My eggs hatching. Come on, please be something good. Ready? It's over. Alright, let's get to this match. Uh, winners finals, Big Buffalo versus Fish at game one going to Battlefield. Oh, Santa had Pikachu. All right, let's get off of this. All right, so looks like Big Buffalo is already down a stock, not even 30 seconds in. But he's putting the pressure on DK right now, so let's see how uh, Fisher can handle it. That up B comes out just super fast. Oh, he goes for glory with the dong punch. Oh, Jesus Christ, I called it a dong punch. You know what? Damn it, I'm just going to call it dong punch. I'll call it whatever the hell I want. I'm done with trying to stay family friendly. Good F smash right there. He's not going to make that back. Almost makes it back, but he doesn't. But um, Fish is still up quite a bit in terms of percent. Fox sitting at 126. Up B out of shield is going to take it. Looks like it's enough to kill Fox as well, not just Puff. Here comes the shine pressure, though. Oh, he bumps his head. Not quite, though. K 
again, this up out of shields is getting everyone. Oh my god. And Fish It, I mean, Big Buffalo's done that stock. Potential three stock for Fish It. Here come the grabs. Chain grabs. Up airs to jab. Alright, up B's gonna get punished. The back air's gonna stuff Fox out right there. The get up attack is gonna miss and is gonna get punished by Fox. Oh boy. Tough situation for Carl. Gets back to the stage. Side B's back, barely makes it back. Because gets F tilted. Back air and is gonna take it. Three stock for Fish It. That's what he sounds like. All right, Big Buffalo's counter pick. I think he's gonna go FD or Yoshi's for some small stage. Mm. Oh no, we're going back. I think we might have a character change. And it's from Big Buffalo. He's gonna switch to Puff and go to FD. This is for... This is for Concussed. Oh, the rest set up. Very nice. Oh, we got a crowd watching Big Buffalo. And there's no rest punish! His shield comes out in time. Up the air shield, though. Not quite far and away. Another one's gonna take the sock. Big Buffalo looking for these rest subs, but the back air is gonna come out. Uh oh. And there's no punish. That, is not how, that does not have a lot of ending lag. Oh, the Donk Punch! But Big Buffalo answers right back with a rest. This will get punished. All right, good trade to break up the combo. Another rest from Big Buffalo, and he has the lead. But he gets clapped. Dies off the top at 88%. Dead even game going the last stock. Alright, Fisher has a Dawn Punch charged up. Oh no! He goes for the rest and misses! But not a big punish. Only eating about 16%. <gasps> Alright, get up attack and knock him away. No jab reset. Big Buffalo is looking for the rest. He's getting, he's getting stuffed out by the back airs. Third back air. The Dawn Punch is online. A fourth back air. Who is this character? Puff? Who is the real Puff? Okay. Up air takes it! And Fisher is one game away from Grand Finals. Let's see if Big Buffalo can take it to a game four. He's got to answer back somehow. Right, we're going to Yoshi's, and Buffalo is staying Puff. Rest right off the bat. Three seconds in, already up a stock. Here comes the Puff. Oh, no, he misses the dare. You hate to see that happen. But here comes a chain grab. Rare example of a chain grab on Puff. Look at that. Didn't know DK could do that. Upspatch is going to take it. I mean, Upspatch is going to miss, but the rest punish is there. Everybody clap your hands. Another rest. Okay. All right, Big Buffalo. But he gets another rest. <laughs> All right, this is looking, starting to look a little bit silly, ladies and gentlemen. Up air. Another rest, but he omps a text it, and here comes a punish. The hammer arm. Arm and hammer. Or Arm and Abe. Okay, uh, Buffalo's just going for too many rests right now. Uh, he's just 
Okay, he needs to cool down. Je okay, Buffalo, that was just not even close. Come on, man. Jesus Christ, Buffalo, come on! Okay. <laughs> Guys, I don't know what the hell's going on right now, okay? Jesus Christ. Alright, uh, alright, uh, okay, no more rest right now. Alright. Vision hasn't been touched to stock. He's looking for it though, I know another rest is coming. There it is! He clutches it out, we're going to game four! The strategy works, ladies and gentlemen! Just spam rest as much as you can and it'll get you somewhere! It'll get you somewhere in life. <laughs> it actually fucking worked. I can't believe that. All right, we're going to Battlefield game number four, um, which is strange because uh, Fish had, uh, Fish had um, won on this came back in game one. Yeah, it looks like the strategy is working. He buffalo with the crouch can with the crouch cancel rest. Or this is a crouch rest, whatever you want to call it. Another rest! He's going to live it this time. Good DI on Fisher's part. Is he going to get a punish? All right, he barely gets the punish, and he's going to die off the top at 90. Uh, he's looking for it. All right, that smash is going to get punished. Here comes the chain grab, but he mashes out. <coughs> Three up airs. Oh, doesn't get a fourth. There's another rest, and he gets dong punched for it. Buffalo going a little bit too wild. Buffalo Wild Wings, man. Buffalo Wild Wings. All right. All right, no punish off stage. The upbeat's gonna save him. That, oh no, he gets battlefielded. The battlefield ledge screwing up everything. Alright, the dash, uh, the four dash is gonna get punched. That is a s not quite a stock, but very good string from DK right there. The donk punch, big Buffalo on his winner side stock right now, down down by two. Someone on the back went. It's not looking good for the puff right now. And he can start going wild with rest. Rest is actually off the table right now. He's sitting at 81. Ashmat does take the stock, but he's got a bit of a mount of the climb. And rest is off the table for this stock. Down smash. Crouch cancel. Down smash is going to take it. Fisher takes it 3 1. And he secures his spot in grand finals. For now, we're going to swap it back to losers. It's I, myself, Toucan versus JLo coming up next. I'll see you guys later.
don't really know why Buffalo decided to do this matchup, but Merck's huge. That'll do it. Dragon's probably dead. Not a good idea, but it almost works. It actually worked. Basic Merc Campbells. Carl is doing an up throw for some reason. Not really Carl sure. Carl has no clue how to play Bowser. I can tell. But but it's, oh, that's a game. Oh. Seems like Adam has the better Bowser today, folks. Seems like Buffalo's Bowser is more of a boozer than a Bowser. Or as some may know, a blowser. No, nope, just a loser. Oh. Yeah, it is Bowser, though. Just need a couple good hits. Just <laughs> getting those hits. Mercs. Good. That'll probably do it. Okay, on to game two. Maybe this one will be a little more serious. That was game two. That was game two? Yeah, game one was DK Fox and Fisher Pong. Oh. I guess Carl just got wrecked. He decided to random a character and Adam just did it in a minute. Oh. Okay, so it's <laughs> Adam's Fox against Buffalo's Dr. Mario. Uh, he used to be a Doc for a little bit. Adam's Fox is pretty not good. <laughs> but apparently it's good enough to beat his Doc. <laughs> good beginnings. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen Adam play Fox in Grand Finals in a tournament, ever. This is surreal. It's more believable, but Fox, not so much. Buffalo's okay, looking so really desperate. Good no, this is some of the worst neutral I've seen in Grands ever. Carl is known for his flailing abilities. I, I don't think either person knows what to do with their character. I think Adam has a... I think Fishit has a better idea. I've seen him play Fox maybe 20 times in two years. <laughs> That's like all he's ever played Fox. I've seen Carl play Doc Mario a few times a Like, that recovery? Normal Foxes wouldn't have even tried. Oh, we got Big Buffalo bringing it back here. That's... that's a dead... Oh, no. It gets out of there with a good up here. Oof. Quick combos. That's Ooh. almost a gimp. Oh, that God. That is a gimp? That's a gimp. Oh. Somehow he's bringing this back. Carl looking like he may take a game here, folks. I don't know. We'll see. It's still too early to decide. Oh, maybe getting good hits off. That, that was a combo. First one all game. I've never seen so many dock photos. I don't know why he didn't just keep. <laughs> and Battlefield. Okay, maybe this one will be serious. One can only hope for that. Um, no, nope, it nope. looks like they're going random. Okay, a Link battle. Oh. So, Adam's Link is probably better than his young Link, but... Oh yeah, Adam's Link, that's for free. And plus... Adam's young Link is actually good, though. No, but Link wins the young Link Link matchup. Yeah, but Adam's young Link's actually good. <laughs> no, but Adam's not going young Link. Adam's normal. I know, which is kind of why I wanted to watch that, and not this. Yeah, once old Link has young Link off stage, it's just kind of over. Yeah, it's really hard for young Link to kill a lot of characters too, especially someone a bit heavier. Yeah. I don't think though that once again either of them are proficient in this match. <laughs> One thing we all know Fish is proficient in is up being out of shield. And that. That's like one of the oldest tricks in the book. I remember watching that in like 
Okay, so Young Link's bomb almost actually saved Adam there. Oh. Oh god. This is just... This is dirty. This is grody. I don't even want to watch the... Oh good. Actual combos. Oh. Oh, we almost had two at combo there. He's hitting him with the money maker, and Buffalo doesn't know what to do. Tricks. I kind of want to see Fish a chain throw. Can <laughs> you do that? <laughs> no, I don't know if you can against Young Link with down throw, but I think so. I know you could tech chase at low percent. Yeah. I meant to say tech chase, not chain throw. I just called it a chain throw because of the chain, but. Up the other. Oh, that kills? I don't know. Let's see. Dead. Oh, whoa. Good angle. And that'll do it. Looks like Fish is gonna just be taking this. Don't think he saw Link, Young Link being game four though of this tournament, the finals. Or a Merc, did I? Yeah, this is right out there. Also, they chose to go to Battlefield on a stage that's just not proficient for either of their recoveries. <laughs> That seemed bad too. I guess it adds a bit more fun to the mix. He could have upbeat and killed him there. Well, Adam's looking like he doesn't know what to do all of a sudden. Oh god, young man. Oh. He's gonna take oh it. Oh my god. Game five. I thought that Fisher would just air dodge and let Carl kill himself. Yeah. I don't know. They're contemplating picking characters for game five. Oh. Oh, Adam's gonna win. Well. Actually, no. Carl. I guess there's always a reset if he loses. Actually. Sheik is one of the few top tiers Carl has never made. Really? Yeah. But does Adam know how to rest? Oh yeah, no. Adam knows how to play this matchup well enough. Even without rest, but he'll probably win. Yeah. Although he did save Sheik just there. I always tell him just go pup or Sheik. He used to play his jigs a lot more, but over the, like, I guess time just made it rust up and he doesn't really choose it too much. I don't know, Jig isn't exactly a tech heavy character. Yeah, I don't know. Some of the rest setups are that frame tight. Could have been punished a lot differently. The fact that Buffalo is going for grabs is not a good sign. <laughs> like, just random grabs in neutral in this matchup is not going to actually get you much. Well, staying Zelda. That'll do it. This is looking pretty dominant in Fishit's favor. Yeah. I don't think Carl... Oh, that was a rest. He actually was perfect for it, too. It looks like Adam just doesn't want to take the rest. Yeah, I guess it's too risky. He's not familiar enough with the character to be but sure that it's Stella going to do it. he'd take 20%. Yeah, he's starting to get to the like point that he can actually die from it, but... Yeah, this should kill. No. Carl was able to get the up air, though. Sheik's uh, fair is actually pretty weak mid-stage, up until like this percent. This would have killed. That'll do it. Well, 
Yeah, Buffalo bringing it back. As I say that, Buffalo <laughs> Falls. I want to see like a Nair rest from this buff. Does Adam have that tech? That, as long as the sheep doesn't TI out at this percent, it'll work. Oh! Why would, why would your air dash on stage? I don't know. Could just grab ledge back air. He was facing the wrong way and probably didn't feel comfortable uh, needle canceling or something to grab it. Yeah, but he also could have just upbeat and still been there before and had that hitbox find him to protect him. So if he upbeat there because of his height, he actually might have been caught on the clip of the level and not actually uh, been off stage. Oh my god. Is Buffalo gonna take this? He has shot no needles. <laughs> it's oh, true. forward throw, yes. Should have down through. Oh, I really don't want Kodo in this. Right? I don't really want to watch another set of random characters. No, I think they'd go real ones that time. I just want to oh, go. That'll do it. Sheik's not recovering from that. And that's the set. Fish, it does it. Farewell, stream. Goodbye. See you soon.